Hello YouTube. I wanted to do a quick video today covering the installation of Yawert. It's a very, very useful um, tool to have at your disposal. What it does is it functions very similar to Pac-Man. If you're not familiar to, or too familiar with Pac-Man, check out Pac-Man 101. I did a video earlier covering that. But what Yawert does is instead of using the Arch Linux repositories to search and install um, programs, it will actually search and install the user repository, which is the AUR, the Arch Linux user repository. But um, this is this is how you, you get to it, and I'm going to show you how to go ahead and install it, because it's, it's like I said, it's an important program. Come up here, um, open up a web browser, and go to aur.archlinux.org. Um, and if you come here, you can actually do a package search right here. And we're going to be looking for Yaourt. Y A O U R T. Spelt kind of weird. But if you look, there it is right there. Click on it. Come up here. Hit enter. And then it's going to bring you the search results. Yaourt is located right here. So let's go ahead and open it up. And here's the page for it. Now, the important thing here is to look right here. The dependencies. Okay? Now, I can tell you this, and because I want to save you a little bit of time. And I don't want this video to go crazy, crazy long. Um, but the dependencies are very important. You need to check all these dependencies to make sure you have them. All you have to do to check to make sure that you have them is to do a Pac-Man search. If you do Pac-Man dash capital S, lowercase s, and then list these off, um, you can you can check, do a query, or rather a search. And if you have it installed, it'll pop up and say installed in parentheses right next to it. I'm not going to do that because we need to get boogieing on this. So the first thing you want to do is I can tell you this right now. Um, package query in a base install of Arch Linux is not there. Okay, It is something that you do have to install. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to come over here and download the tarball is what it says. Okay, And that's just the package. You're going to want to do it for this program, um, which this one right here is Yaourt. Okay, so you're going to download Yower. But then you're also going to want to get Package Query as well. So you click on it, and then it brings you here to Package Query. Uh, you're also going to want to check the dependencies here, but I can also tell you this. You're going to have these. Okay, so all you need to do is come over here and download this tarball. So you have now downloaded two tarballs, one called Package Query and the other one called... Um, Yower. All right. Now I'm going to go ahead and close this out. What I've done is I've taken those tar packages, um, which are these files right here, and I've moved them into a folder that I created called Programs. Um, you can choose to do this or not, um, but what you do, what you do want to do is you want to, you want to open up a terminal, okay, and navigate to this location. And for me, like I said, it's home programs. That's, like I said, I created one called programs for this. And this is how um, you install it. First, you always ins always install the dependency first. So we're, we, we're going to have to do package query and take care of that tar, that tar first and get it installed. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to do it. Now the process for both of these is going to be the same. Okay? Um, and... Let's go ahead and start with the package query because that's the dependency. So what you're going to do is you're going to type in tar and dash xf and then package query. Okay? Package dash query dot tar dot gz. Hit enter. And then if you look over here, it created a directory. Now you're going to want to go to, go into that directory. Okay, so you're going to CD into package query, hit enter, and if you look right here, now it shows that you are in that directory. So if you do a quick LS, what you should see is a package build. Okay, once you're here, you can actually go ahead and make the package. All right, so you want to do make package PKG. All right, that's what you want to do. The uh, switches we're going to use is CIS. 
So hit enter, and it, now it's going to actually go through and start creating the package and uh, getting it installed. So it's, I'll go ahead and let it run through here real quick. It doesn't take that long to do it, but that's what it's doing. Now we got to put in our password. Go ahead and do that. Proceed with the installation. Yes. And now when it says cleaning up and you're back at your prompt, you're okay. But if you look, let me go ahead and clear this out. If you look at where you're at, you're still in this file or this folder right here. That's where you're located. We want to back up out of this. So we're going to do a CD and then dot dot, CD space dot dot. And that's going to back us up. So now we're in this main program. And the way you can double check that is if you hit LS, you'll list everything in here. It'll show you the one folder that we created. We were just in a little bit ago. It'll show you the downloaded files. Now we're going to do Yower. And we're going to do it the same way. We're going to tar Yower. Hit enter. Or I'm sorry. Tar. And you got to put in XF. you got to do the switches. And then Yower. That's my mistake. Sorry about that. So then it will actually go through and it'll do the same thing. It'll create the directory. Now we want to go into that directory. So we're going to CD into, into Yower, hit enter. Now you'll see it changed just like it did the last time. So now we're in this directory and let's check to make sure that the package build is there. It is. We're going to do it the same way. Make PKG and use the CIS switch and let it go ahead and install Yower. Hit yes. Now cleaning up and it's done. Okay. So now we can actually use Yower. Well, how do you use Yaward? Yaward is used the exact same way, really, as far as I can tell, it's used the exact same way that Pac-Man is. But instead, instead of uh, using Pac-Man, you're going to use Yaward. And one thing about Yaward is you do not use it as root. That is a difference. You're not going to do a pseudo Yaward. You're just going to do Yaward. Okay? Yaward and the switches I believe are the same so let's just find Yaourt Y-A-O-U-R-T and it'll do the same thing see and you go right here and it shows it in the in the repository so anything that you may need um, that you can't find in the uh, in the Pac-Man Arch Linux repositories you may be able to find here now understand, this is these are the user repositories, so use this at your own risk. But, you know, like for, you know, general things that, that you may know of that are already, you know, trusted programs, this might be where you can find it. Um, Yaour is a very useful program, but as I said, just, you know, exercise some caution when you're, when you're installing things from Yaour for that reason. So with that... I've now shown you how to install Yower. You should be ready to go with it. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and end this video. And we'll see you on the next one. Hey, thanks for watching. And tune back soon. I'll be putting uh, more videos up. Have a great one.